Hey guys, welcome back. Today what we're going to do is we're going to show you how to cover up the flaws that are in the dollhouse when the wood meets. First thing we did was we took some cardstock and we cut it and made a template. And then we drew our line right on the corners. Okay, after that we took a piece of cardstock and we cut it to the right height and then we transferred our lines on there. Back. On the back of it. That way you won't see it. Okay, now you're going to cut down the length with a pair of really sharp scissors and you want to square it off or you can use a paper cutter. We'll be right back. Okay, so once you have your piece measured, you're going to use a ruler and you're going to use the back of a knife and you're going to score it so that you can fold it on the side with your pencils, with your pencil to, mark. Best to have a wood ruler with, with the, the, the metal edge that's implanted in the ruler. I use the back edge, not the cutting edge, the back edge. It's always good to have somebody to help you hold it because otherwise it could possibly move. The back edge very lightly. There you go. One line. You're not cutting through the paper. Bring it over a little bit. Where's the knife? Am I there? I can't see the line. All that really does is put a little indentation in it so it makes it easier to fold, as you can see. It doesn't cut through it. <coughs> well, let's see how we do here. Now you're just going to fold it the rest of the way with your hand. And the two ends, you're folding the opposite direction so that they'll overlap where the siding can go on top. I have to take a hair off of the top of here. Okay, so once you have it on there and you have it fit, you're going to take some glue and you're going to glue it to it. When it dries, then you'll cut your windows out. You cut it to take a little off of this. Stay in here, mark it. Okay, so follow part two for how we glue it on, and then part three of cutting the windows out. Don't forget to follow Dollhouse Miniature Madness and Tutorials on Facebook for more DIYs. Thanks a lot. Have a great day.